Hey guys, thanks for coming to this video. So today I'm going to be testing out a bunch of awesome products from a beautiful company called Brow Bar by Rima. Um, they sent me a big box of goodies. So if you guys are interested in seeing how they work and all about these products and seeing how I got this look today, then let's get into it. So like a month and a half ago, I got a message from Brow Bar by Rima and they wanted to send me some stuff. So I was like, sure. And I was expecting like a brow pencil or two or something, but they sent this gorgeous box and inside like all of this stuff. And I'm so excited. It's so gorgeous and like luxurious looking so i'm excited to test it all out and see what this brand's all about but we got uh some face palettes we have brow products we have brushes we have lashes in here some lip stuff so i'm excited to test it all out and see what kind of look i can create today let's just get you guys zoomed in and we'll start since it's brow bar let's start with some brows so i have two different brow palettes they have powders in them i have medium and light so in each of these you have two different colors of powder you have i think it's like just a clear brow gel you have this awesome little brow brush I forgot the word brush for a minute so it's a little double-ended brow brush and then you have some concealer to help kind of carve out and shape those brows so those look really nice and these like the packaging is gorgeous it's this pretty gold like it feels kind of heavy. It's not like flimsy and cheap. So this brand looks really nice. So let's test this out. I also got for brows, it's their medium brown. Um, it's like a one of those little pens with the little, like three little lines to give you those like hair stroke look. So I think I'm gonna start with this and then go in with some powder. So I don't usually like pens like this, for me at least but we'll see. I feel like if you already have some, if you already have like a lot of brows, you just want to add like a tiny, tiny bit. This is probably going to work best for someone like that. For me, when you like hardly have any brow to work with, I find that these don't do enough, but Cause see like on the tail end, like where I have no hair, this isn't doing enough. I need something more pigmented. So that's why we'll go in with the powder, but we'll see. I mean, it's adding a little bit. You can, you can see the difference. Oh, I think I forgot to say thank you to Brow Bar by Rima when I was talking about them sending me stuff. Um, thank you guys so much for sending me this. It's so sweet and I am so excited. So thank you. <laughs> So I'm gonna stop there with that brush and I'm gonna go into the light brow powder. Go in with the little more angled side first. I was going into the middle shade, the darker one. I feel like it's a little too warm toned. So let's try the medium and I'm just gonna use the lighter shade. So that's pretty good. So I really like that. I'm gonna go into the concealer part. So 
that's very nice. I'm not the biggest brow powder fan. I would rather use either a brow pencil, like a retractable pencil, pencil or some kind of pomade. That's just more what I like. But for a powder, I really like it. I think the tone of it is really nice. It wasn't too cool or too warm. Um, the first palette that I feel like if you're more blonde haired, this would work really well. Um, but definitely go for the medium if you have, if you're normal, like brown hair. Um, I think this one's just too light for me. So now I'm gonna take some of that clear brow gel and set my brows if I can open it. So now I'm gonna go in with some eyeshadow. I have these two, uh, they're face palettes. I have BH Nude and Sugar Daddy. So they just, they look like this. So their face palettes seem to be the same, except for these four uh, shades right here. So everything else is the same. And to be honest, these colors aren't really like what I, want in a palette i'm just not really drawn to them so i'm still interested in testing them out and seeing you know what i can do with them but they also sent me this brush kit so i'm going to get some brushes out of here it's really pretty gold brushes so i'm going to start with the more rounded fluffy brush i'm going to go in with this shade right here That blended so nice and it's so like even. I guess I'll go in with this like kind of mauvey purpley magenta-y color right here, berry shade, a little bit smaller brush. I'm gonna take this kind of shimmery pink on the lid. Ooh, that's nice. It's a really nice, like soft shimmery shade that just makes the makes your lid look so nice and even and like doesn't accentuate any fine lines and wrinkles. So I'm gonna use their kind of bigger flat brush and I'm gonna go in to these two shades, the pink and then the kind of matte white for a brow bone highlight. Which I typically use like a more rounded flat brush for this, but this will work. Then going in with that first shade underneath. Then the more berry shade. So I'm gonna try going into this shade right here. I think that's supposed to be a highlight. It's like a little golden. So I'm gonna take this brush and see if we can highlight with that. It's really weird because it looks really dark in the pan. Like it doesn't look like a normal highlight that I would use, but I think it looks nice. So I love this little brush for highlighting the nose and inner corner. I'm 
I'm just gonna add a little pop of my Pure Afterglow highlight to make the highlight a little bit more. So I'm gonna do some liquid eyeliner. I'll be right back. So I'm gonna test out their like lipstick that they sent. This is the shade Rodeo Row. It's not really a color I would probably choose, but I'm just gonna try it on. It looks really nice and creamy, so let's see. So I went ahead and put on the lashes and the uh, lipstick, which the lipstick I really like. How does it have fuzzies on it? There's fuzzies everywhere here. But it went on a lot lighter and peachier than I would have thought. So I really like that. It's nice and creamy, feels really nice. It doesn't have a scent. And then I did use also the blush in this, the face palette, which it looks like a scary blush, but it went on really nice and I just used their bigger fluffy brush for that. This guy right here, the biggest one, which this is probably more for just like an all over face powder brush or um, bronzer brush, but I think for the blush, it just helped blend it and blow it out so it's not, it's not too crazy for me, which is what I like in a blush. I like it to just kind of be a nice light flush of color. I really am enjoying all of this stuff. So again, thank you so much to Brow Bar by Rima for sending me this stuff. I really love it. These lashes are gorgeous. They're just so like fluttery. They're really natural looking. So they're not going to be like these crazy, like everyone can see from across the room that you're wearing fake lashes. They're just really nice and natural. They just look really beautiful. Everything just looks is, is so great. Like the packaging is amazing. The quality is great. That's it for this video, you guys. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next video. Bye guys.